what is up guys welcome back to another video so today we have the buffed rocket raccoon uh we are here in the main server we're gonna test him out as a six star rank one champion unduped uh and in the uh ccp beta he's still the old rocket uh so whenever his buff gets added in that server i'm gonna do a six star rank three gameplay with and without suicides just so we can see his damage as well but here we're gonna explain his uh utility and see a little bit of his damage so each hit on my combo meter uh, increases my critical rating by quite a bit. So you're going to see a lot of crits. As you can see, that was a 5 combo with all crits. And each time we crit, we gain two of those scrap metals uh, that now I have 50, which is the cap, by the way. But against this Winter Soldier, he's metal. So for metal champions, you grant three instead of two for each crit. And right there, we consumed all of our scrap metal, all 50 of, the, of them. Uh, to increase our special two because the more scrap metal you have the, the harder it hits and also the armor breaks the armor breaks is, is more potent as well uh which is really nice you want to have as many as possible uh, before you throw that sp2 and this armor break lasts for 30 seconds so i'm going to show you now that you can stack it as well Let's take a look at this damage 40,000 from the last hit and we have big armor breaks as well after this and you can see it's like almost a guaranteed chris to be honest and then Rocket Raccoon, he's got another of his uh, abilities. So he, he consumed 25 of this scrap metal to activate the shield, shield system built. So this gives you increased armor rating, increased uh, physical resistance, and increased, or you gain 20% or 30% special attack resistance, which is pretty nice. Um, and also, if you were to get hit, you're going to see that I'm not going to lose my combo. It's going to say shield system activated. That basically acts like a combo shield. And after this runs out, you don't have the uh, the buffs, the armor rating and all that stuff. So if you were to get hit, that's the only reason you would lose it. Uh, but you can still get it back when you have 25 scrap metal to use it and uh, activate it back again, like here, which is really nice. And also you can block unblockable specials from uh, mutants here, but we're not going to showcase that. But yeah, man, he's like really strong. Look at, take a look at this damage, man. Let's see the special two with 40 scrap metal. 37,000, man, for a 6-star rank 1, this is without synergies, without anything. That is really beautiful to see, man. A lot of crits. This guy is going to be probably an MVP for this meta we have in BGs right now. Uh, with the uh, crit me with your best shot. Because he hits hard, bro. That is really good. Now let's go ahead and fight this Captain Marvel. She's not metal, so let's see how the rotation is uh, when we're not fighting a metal champion. So we're gonna get two instead of three and now i'm gonna showcase the special one and the special three and the heavy attack so for the heavy attack uh the first hit uh grants the opponent an armor break and you consume uh i think you consume 10 scrap metal to activate it so as you can see now we have 24 i'm gonna use a heavy there's an armor break and we consume 10. so that lasts for quite a bit of time as well uh it lasts for 15 seconds which is not bad and then let's go for the special three right now. And this can stack up to uh, five times, by the way, uh, this armor break. So that's a very easy access to armor break. Now let's pop that special three, the very good looking special three. So you consume all your scrap metal to inflict a 20, 12 power drain uh, debuff, 12 second power drain debuff, uh, which can drain up to two bars of power. So if you consume 50, you power drain two bars of power. Now we consume like 30. So it's not going to be as strong, but pretty strong. And also the opponent is special locked, which is really, really nice. And we have a 30 second bleed, which is not taking for uh, for much, but that is because it's lasting for 30 seconds. Really amazing. And then we have that special one, which power drains. You consume your scrap metal. You consume uh, each hit consumes um, uh, some scrap metal. And the more you consume, the more power drain you get. Like, as you can see, that power drain is really, really nice. Like, let's let's see it again with uh, 40 scrap metal. See, like, they are getting power drain quite a bit. It's not, it's not too bad. So it says that you consume 15 scrap metal for each hit to power drain uh, up to 15% of a bar of power. Of the opponent's, uh, sorry, current power over one second. So the power drain is going to be super, super strong if the opponent has a lot of power. So let's try and see it here. Let's make him uh, make her special lock again. There we go. 
And also I forgot to mention that each hit inflicts a rupture effect as well. But yeah, this is really, really nice mail. Now we're going to have like 50 scrap metal or something. I'm going to try. Just so we can see that power drain. It's going to be super, super high because she is... Just, she already has three bars of power, so it's going to be super, super strong. But yeah, this is definitely not his uh, damage rotation of the special ones. It's just the more utility from the special ones. So let's just power gain, man. Let's actually try and build up to 50 or something. And when this power lock uh, runs out, there goes your special lock as well. But yeah, that wasn't bad. That's like almost a bar of power. And that is definitely not bad. Like, you can definitely use it to avoid maybe taking a special three to the face. So that's not bad. Let's go for a special two. Let's go for the big armor break. We might die from suicides, but that was big damage for a uh, class disadvantage. And now we have guaranteed crit, basically, man, with 150 hits. That reminds me of the old Rocket Raccoon. So nice. The pre-12.0. Yeah, we, we might die from suicides, but it's okay. Yep, we died from suicides. So yeah, man, that is all his utility. Uh, let's go again for a Winter Soldier fight. Uh, just so I can uh, just go for special twos and try and build up all those armor breaks from the heavy attack. Just so we can see how much damage we can do. And also, we can do something else. We can add uh, one of his synergies, which makes our scrap metal, uh, the cap, it increases it by 10. Which is nice, because we can consume more from that special two and get more damage. This is nice. If we infiltrate an armor break, we get a uh, armor up. So we can add that as well. It's pretty cool for Havoc and that stuff. But he's good counter for like... Havoc, because you have the armor break, you have the power drain, and also you have that uh, armor break for that killmonger. Really, really nice. Like, he's he's not bad. Definitely not bad. Let's see his damage though. as a six star rank one. We're going to try and build up our combo, get a lot of crits, and then we can throw that heavy attack as well. Consume 10 scrap metal and inflict an armor break. Let's see how it goes. Okay, let me go for heavy here. So now we get the armor up from the synergy. Um, I think I can get my... Uh... Yeah, let's actually hold block for a second. Uh, ju just so we can build up the shield, just in case we take the damage. Or take a hit and uh, lose our combo. Now we are safe. That's a good armor break right there. And then now I wonder if we can get to 60 scrap metal uh, before we get to that special 2. Because uh, I kind of want to throw it with 60 just so we can see the number. With plus 10 uh, scrap metal. And I think that's going to be possible. Because we gained 3 against this uh, metal winter soldier. So it's, it's going to be possible. Look at those crits man. So let's go through it with 60. That's going to deal a lot of damage. So that was 47,000 for a 6 star rank 1 champion. Oh man that's a lot. <laughs> Definitely a lot. Okay let's actually try and stack it. Because this armor break is more potent. Because we have... Use this special two with more scrap metal, which is really, really nice. So let's try and race to that special two again. And now we have 60, so let's just throw it. Boom! That was 50,000. Now let's see our medium attacks. Dude, almost 6,000 medium attacks for a 6 star rank 1. And critting so much adds his damage up so much, man. That is ridiculous. That's very, very good. But if you want to go for the uh, damage rotation, you're definitely going to pop those special twos. Uh, but let me go for some heavy attacks in the corner, maybe. Just so we can see our damage. This armor break is not too, too strong, but it definitely helps. So we got three right now. Let's throw that special two with uh, 53 scrap metal. Boom. Okay. Not too shabby. I don't have assassins. And yeah, man, that's gonna be it. Let's throw that special one, get those ruptures. And that's it, dude. He is, he is strong. How many hits? That was 121 hits. That's definitely not bad. 121 hits for a six star rank one. I will take that. And now let's actually go ahead and explain what the signature ability does. So in order to do this, I'm gonna have to duel uh, one of my champions. So let's duel a metal champion. Uh, and I'll explain why. So I'm gonna take the five star rocket raccoon, which is uh, awakened. Uh, where is... Oh, I have it here. Okay, I have it here. <laughs> so basically, infl we inflict the opponent with an armor break now. The opponent is passively heal blocked until that armor break expires. So this is going to be really nice for uh, my defender because I have suicides. Uh, but here I want to try and get to those uh, scrap metal, the 10, so we can actually for go for heavy. And inflict that armor break. And there we go. So as you can see now, 
we have a passive field block. And that's a very, very big armor break, man. It lasts for like 30, uh, 30 seconds, I think. Does it? No, it lasts for 15 seconds, but dude, that was... That's a nice utility just having him awakened. You join the SIGs on that, and then the only thing that changes here with the, the SIGs is that when you dash back and hold block... Uh, let's actually go for another. Uh, when you dash back and hold block, uh, you also gain some critical resistance and some uh, block proficiency. So this is really nice for the long fights. You want to have that block proficiency because Rocket Raccoon is definitely a bit squishy for sure. And that's really nice. And also, this is not working because I think willpower doesn't count as uh, trying to regen health. Um, the opponent is supposed to get power drained when they're trying to heal. And you also and you have that heal block on them. Uh, but it doesn't count as uh, on willpower here because as you can see, it doesn't power drain. Oh, it says power drain. I don't see any power gain though, right? See, it, it says power gain. Okay, he's losing power. Actually, he's losing power. So willpower does count. It's not too much because I don't have him mat match uh ma max sig. Uh but that is working. So yeah, how it says it is like whenever the opponent would regen, inflict the opponent with a power drain debuff, draining 5% of their current uh, power over 0.5 seconds uh per hour break debuff. So if you can stack those hour break debuffs, uh maybe I can actually try it here. I think my CGR is the most tanky one, so I'm just going to go with a lower uh, rarity raccoon. Let's go, go for the three star. I'm going to try and stack those armor breaks and see if this power gene is actually insane. Because that wasn't too great, but you can definitely see the difference. So now we got to build up those crits. And uh, let's actually go for like maybe 30 so we can go for three armor breaks. Let's see. Okay, I got a Dex special too, though. That's scary. <laughs> Come on, bro. Okay, there we go. So we Dexed it. Now, let's go with the heavy attacks. So the uh, power gen is not the greatest. Oh, you can see the difference here with the SIGs. For sure. Okay, that's not bad. Definitely not bad, dude. Wow. And I'm definitely damnation, but... Wow, the difference of the SIGs are actually nice. Uh, for this guy wow yeah that is that is amazing dude that's some nice utility just having him awakened he's got th two ways to power drain the special one um and then this awaken ability and pretty much everyone like let's say bgs everyone has willpower 99 percent of the players have uh willpower so you're gonna activate that ability they're gonna get power drain kind of like warlock's ability uh when they are trying to heal He's got two ways to power to power drain. Actually, three, because the, the SP3 power drains as well. And it inflicts a special lock, which is really nice. Uh, Rocket Raccoon is really tanky with that physical resistance, the armor rating, the special attack resistance, the crit resistance, and the block proficiency when you have that shield active, if you have them awakened too. Very, very good. And then the special two just inflicts a lot of damage and easy access to armor breaks. Dude, I think this guy is, is pretty solid. Like, I'm going to take my, my Raccoon up. Uh, if I ever get him awakened, uh, he seems really good, honestly. I love that he crits so much. If you if you even have like 28 in your combo meter, you have like almost guaranteed. It's never going to be guaranteed, but it's so high. Like you're going to crit on Doom. That is really crazy. Uh, but yeah, guys, let me know what you think about Rocket Raccoon. I think he's a very solid champion now. Definitely a good glass cannon for sure. Very helpful for this. Uh, crit me with your best shot meta for uh, Battlegrounds. And yeah, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like, subscribe, and I will see you in the next one.